Here's how to play Ares in Smite 2. If you played Ares in Smite 1, you're in good shape because his kit is pretty similar. But if you didn't play him in Smite 1, don't worry, we'll cover the basics. The biggest change to Ares' kit in Smite 2 is his passive, Blessed Armaments. What this does is, is it provides a strength and intelligence buff in an aura around Ares based off of what you build. If you want to increase the strength aura, build protections. If you want to increase your intelligence aura, build cooldown. Both those auras are increased with each level that Ares gains. 50% of the buff is applied to allies. The first ability you want to unlock for Ares is the Searing Flesh ability, which is his third ability. Basically, Ares just does magical damage in a cone out in front of him. One good thing about this ability is you are immune to displacement while channeling this ability. The second ability you want to unlock is Shackles, and this is Ares' main form of CC in his kit. What it does is it fires out a chain in a line and stops on enemy gods, dealing damage and crippling them. Now, an important thing about this ability is you can fire it up to three times if you land a hit on an enemy god. To maximize the damage with this ability, you want to fire your chain, auto attack, fire your chain, auto attack, fire your chain. Ares' third ability is Call to Arms. What this does creates an aura in a circle around you that applies magical and physical protection and basic attack damage to you and allies in your aura. A key thing to note with this ability is damaging enemy gods increases the duration of the effect. Ares' fourth ability is No Escape. Ares creates a circle around him, chaining all enemy gods within it, and after a short duration, he pulls all enemy gods to him and stuns them. While channeling this ability, you are CC immune and gain damage mitigations. A really important thing to note if you want to take Ares to the next level is auto attack cancelling. And what that is, is using your abilities to stop the animation of your auto attacks, allowing you to get more damage off more quickly. And that's just like what I mentioned earlier with Ares' shackle ability, is chaining, auto attacking, chaining, auto attacking, chaining. And to maximize this, you want to be using your chain before your auto attack is finished casting to maximize your DPS. And that's your basic guide for how to play Ares in Smite 2.